The chupacabra is a legendary creature in the folklore of parts of the Americas, with its first alleged sightings reported in Puerto Rico in 1995. The creature was said to attack small farm animals by sucking their blood. In this episode we're going to analyze evidence and facts about this elusive cryptid. The chupacabra, as it's known in English, comes from its name in Spanish, chupacabras. The word chupacabras comes from the word chupar, which means to suck, and cabras, meaning goats. So it basically means goat sucker. There have been various descriptions of the chupacabra over the years. One of the most common is that the creature is supposed to be approximately 3 to 4 feet high, reptile-like, with leathery or scaly greenish-gray skin, and sharp spines or quills reaching from the neck to the base of the tail. In 1995, eight sheep were found dead in Puerto Rico. They were completely drained of blood, and each of them allegedly had three puncture wounds in the chest area. The attacks were eventually attributed to the chupacabra. There were multiple reports of farm animals being killed in a similar fashion over the years. Each of the animals was reported to have had its body bled dry, through a series of small circular incisions. Shortly after the first reported incidents in Puerto Rico, other animal deaths were reported in several Latin American countries and other regions of the United States. A veterinarian analyzed 300 reported chupacabra victims and concluded that they had not been bled dry. The reports of bloodsucking by the chupacabra were never confirmed by a necropsy. Initially, the animal killings were attributed to a satanic cult, but there's no evidence to support this claim. Even though there is no concrete evidence of the chupacabra, there's always the possibility of it being an undiscovered species or even a supernatural entity. Or maybe even a being of alien origin. It could also be possible that people suffered mass hysteria and started seeing things that weren't there and embellished their alleged encounters with the creature. Give us your opinion. What do you think about this strange creature? Is it real? Is it a figment of people's imagination? Drop us a line in the comments section.